Hello, this is Brad Tallis with NextGen Solutions, and welcome to this week's Fusion Friday. This week's topic is taking a look at the enhancements made to the offset command. So let's dive right in. So Autodesk has made some great enhancements to the offset command. So if I go into offset and I select on this edge right here, you'll notice it's selecting the whole thing and that's because of this chain selection and I can specify a distance, let's just say 0.25 in this case. Now in previous versions, you could not offset an offset. So for example, I could not offset this edge, but now you can. So for example, I'll say 0.5 in this case. So this is a huge enhancement. Um, a lot of customers have been asking for that, so I wanted to point that out. Let me go ahead and undo that really quick. One of the other things that we have is this two sides. So if I go ahead and turn on two sides, you'll notice it also gives me the option for linking the offsets. So I'll go ahead and turn that on. And what this allows you to do is it's going to offset in both directions. So I'll go ahead and say 0.2, and you'll see that it created a dimension of 0.2, and then it referenced that for the inside offset. So if I change this to 0.4, that other one will change to 0.4. Now, if I didn't have that option, I'll go ahead and turn off link offsets. I'll, I'll still do the two sides. So let's go ahead and say you know, 0.2. These are now two different offsets. So I could come back in here and say make that 0.3 and it's gonna keep the original line. It's gonna keep the 0.2 offset, but it modified the 0.3 offset. So it's a kind of a cool way to create multiple offsets that way. So here's another example um, that's going to show some of the enhancements to the offset command, uh, and that is this match topology option. So I'm going to go ahead and select my curves, and as I drag out, we can see that it's matching the topology. It's, it's creating an exact offset of that. But as I keep dragging, we can see that this little pocket is going to get smaller and smaller. And if I continue to drag, you'll notice I get an error message saying that it can't match the topology uh, any larger than this 0.5 offset that I'm doing. The same thing happens if I go inside. You'll notice I can only go a certain distance and then it stops because it would then not be able to match the, the straight edge topology that matches with this uh, fillet right here. So it can only go a very specific distance by using this match topology. If I were to turn that off, I get this result where it's going to look the same like it's matching, but if I go a little bit further, it's going to basically get rid of that and it's just going to offset the overall shape of, of the original uh, selection. Same thing if I were to go inside, you'll notice it basically gets rid of those fillets and it turns to these points, for example. Now, with that said, um, you, you can't do both. And what do I mean by that? Well, I'm going to come in here and say match topology. And let's just offset, um, you know, minus 0.35, for example. Okay. Then I'm going to offset this again. But I, I want it to go further than this 0.15. So I'm going to turn off match topology. So I can come in here and say like 0.4, but you'll notice I get an error message. I can't select offset constrained curves that don't match the topology of the parent curves. And you'll notice that the OK button is grayed out. So they, they all have to be matched or they all have to be not matched for that to work. So give the new offset command a try. Play around with the new functionality and see what you can do with the new enhancements to the offset command. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, all I ask is that you give the video a thumbs up and share or repost the video with others in your network. This will help spread the knowledge of Fusion out to the community. If you have any comments or ideas for future topics, 
please reach out to me at bradtallis at nextgensolutions.com. And I look forward to seeing you on the next Fusion Friday.